We are going to show you Charlie and Monkey's cages. This is their little homes. Um, this first one is Charlie's cage, and Monkey is in there having a little snack. And they got lots of toys and lots of feeding things. This coconut always holds their special treats and their water dish and their vegetables, which is always in there every, fresh every day with all different vegetables, a cuddle bone and hang up sticks and Charlie's bed. And on top, he has this crochet thing that I have for him and he loves it because he wipes his face on it all the time. And this here is a toy that I made for them just the other day, which they seem to really like tearing apart. Yes, and there's Charlie. They just finished playing, so he's getting tired and he's going to have a little nap. And that's Kale on top. And this one over here, this cage here, is um, Monkey's cage, which is identical. So I have the inside bars open so that they can um, go through and visit each other inside until bedtime when I close it up. And um, in Monkey's cage, he's got his seeds and his, and his water dish, and he's still got lots of vegetables in there. And that is Monkey. He is over here eating now. And Charlie came over to say hi. And where Monkey sleeps, Monkey don't like having a bed, so Monkey sleeps... I'm trying not to let Charlie jump on me, but Monkey sleeps on this stick right here. And um, he's got all these little uh, things around so that he feels nice and safe. But he doesn't like a cover, and he don't like um, the bed. So that's, that's that. So that's why I have to separate them at night, because Charlie likes having a cover, and he likes sleeping in his hut and monkey don't like either. So at bedtime, I, I push the cages apart and close the, the little in-between gates until morning. Charlie, say kiss you. Kiss. Kiss. I kiss you. Charlie. Uh, he's not going to talk, as usual, camera shy.